Cancer or moon child as we like to refer to you. Welcome to your reading for this week starting the 30th of June. It's a general reading so take from it everything that resonates with you and leave anything else behind. I'm using my teacup tarot cards and my time to shine oracle cards. So starting off with your overall energy we've got the ace of pencils. This is lovely. This is something new. This is new ideas. This is clarity coming in. This is you working things out and enjoying that light bulb moment that goes along with that. Your help or your hurdle, card 12, Awakening, says be lovely individual you. It also says remember to look at things from everybody's perspective. So take a step back, look at the bigger picture and look at things from all angles. What do you need to focus on? A brand new opportunity. The Four of Teacups says you might be so focused in one direction that you're missing a golden opportunity right behind you. So this card says stand back and look at the bigger picture. Look, all she has to do is turn around and she'll see this fabulous teacup full of tea and a teapot right behind her. All she has to do is turn round. So this week, don't be overly focused in one direction or on one thing that you miss an opportunity right beside you. How can you help yourself? Three of teacups is lovely. It's the card of good news. It's happiness. It's celebrating. It's going out with friends, social invitations, literally what it says on the card. Pulling it all together, the Seven of Teacups says, just think things through. This is about choices and decisions. And on the card, look, she's got seven, it's the Seven of Teacups. She's got seven teacups in front of her. And she's needing to make a choice. So she's standing back and she's looking at all these teacups. Now, most of them have lovely things in, like a star or a bar of chocolate. But there's one down here with a grumpy gingerbread man in it and she doesn't want to choose him. So she's assessing all her options carefully before deciding. The outcome, the Ten of Wands, is absolutely lovely. This says the difficult times are over with, the busy times are over with. And all this says is time for you to rest and relax, put your feet up, gather your energy and then you'll be ready for the next adventure. So moving on to the Time to Shine Oracle cards. We've got the Six of Thought. I've literally said moving on to the next adventure and this is the next card. The Six of Thought says time to move on. Enjoy an improving, in, uh, an improving situation. Sometimes it means going on holiday. But generally this is you moving on and feeling good. How can you help yourself? We've got the 16 of Wisdom. This is lovely. This is the Life Changes card in my tarot deck. This is you making positive life changes, finding what you're looking for, focusing on what you do well, doing what you love, loving what you do. So we've got a lovely energy here of you looking at things from all directions, making wise and sensible choices and based on that, making positive change and moving forward. The Seven of Emotion. Same card, different deck. This is the angels talking in a loud voice or the universe emailing you in capital letters. Careful choices and decisions. Literally what I've just said. How can you help yourself? The Three of Wisdom. This is lovely. This is the Empress card in traditional tarot. Time to take action, start new projects, get busy doing, not just thinking about doing, intending to do or hoping to do. The Empress card. She's busy. She's got her apron on. She's got her sleeves rolled up and she's taking action steps on these new ideas. This could well be on these positive changes. You getting busy making those changes. Pulling it all together, we've got the Two of Life. This is the card of balance. 
So this asks you to be conscious of financial balance, work-life balance, how much time do you give to other people, how much time do you take for yourself. All these things need putting into balance this week. And your final outcome card is lovely, the chariot card, the seven of wisdom. This is you. It says time to make a move forward. Take action with balance and with discipline. So this is well thought out. So you're clearly going to take notice of these seven of teacups card. Choosing wisely, assessing the situation. In comes the clarity the new ideas, the new information. This is you assessing it, looking at the bigger picture, taking your time, just re-energizing. And this 10 of wands is about you getting ready for this fabulous new start. And then literally here it is, reason to celebrate you moving on and feeling good, taking action on those positive changes, bringing life into balance, keeping life in balance, and then there's no stopping you. The seven of wisdom, you're on your way. So a lovely reading for you, Cancer. I hope you've enjoyed it. Thank you for listening. Thank you for watching. And thank you even more for liking, sharing and subscribing. It truly does support my channel and I'm so grateful for that. So look after yourselves. Have a lovely week. And I'll see you here again soon.